My name is Tulis Rejak. I work for the South African National Biodiversity Institute in the Biological Invasions Directorate. It is necessary to work on invasive species, controlling them, to conserve our natural resources, the water, to conserve our biodiversity. What my work entails is mainly getting out into the field, getting the population sizes of the species and collecting all the correct field data, taking the samples to the taxonomist. They are the key people in our line of work in giving us the correct identification of the species. <laughs> my name is Ndombifi Lepaliso. I am born and bred in Soweto and I am a taxonomist here at the South African National Biodiversity Institute. Through taxonomy, we're able to give names to organisms based on their physical attributes, their characteristics, and in that way, lumping them together to give a system to the organisms that we have in our biodiversity. Taxonomy is very important in uh, alien invasive species and the understanding thereof. If you know what something is, you're able to then use the knowledge from that characterization of that species to then circumvent the proliferation of those species, but you're also able to better understand the structure of those species, which helps you in you know, things like eradicating them and controlling the spread of invasive species. The tricky part comes in when alien invasives are very, very similar to indigenous species. In that case, you need to be very rigorous because sometimes the difference is something as small as, you know, leaf hairs looking one way and not the other. You, you need to run through the process in a detailed manner to be able to pass the information on to the invasive species team so that they then can use information that is, that is accurate and don't cause any kind of backlash to our indigenous biota. Yes, I am for hopeful that we can win uh, the battle on invasive species, you know, as long as we are able to take actions on these species whilst they are still in their early stages of invasion, so in that way we can stop them from expanding. It's through our work that we're able to then protect and conserve our biodiversity and be able to frame it in a way that is accessible and usable to the everyday South African. We're here to safeguard biodiversity one species at a time.